love is the closest thing to magic. And that when you experience it, riches and success and status doesn't matter. Except for that other person. For where you go, I go. Where your home shall be, so my show home shall be. Your family shall be my family, your friends shall be my friends, and your God shall be my God. When I was 18, I fell in love with a little girl who had sparkly gray eyes and dark hair and filled our house with first laughter and then song, and always love. Peyton came to us with her own brand of magic. There's always an air of selfishness that comes along with welcoming uh, or accepting a brother or sister-in-law. We all want what's best for our siblings, obviously, and we hope that new family additions are always gonna be positive experiences. I would be regretful if I didn't point out how Jacob has not only met my expectations, but far exceeded any of them that I would have ever had. So uh, let's toast to that as my third. Or chug to Jacob. And I, yeah, for real. joined together, let not man put asunder. Ready, Jacob, kiss that bride. probably doesn't remember this, but as we were walking out of Starbucks, she mentioned something she admired about Jacob. It was a characteristic of his that she described so perfectly and so accurately as if she had already known him for as long as I had. And it was in that moment when it registered with me that she genuinely knew and cared for my brother. Imagine at the same time that there was a little Jacob filling his own home with love, ease, and a charm that is unlike anything I've ever known. As you join together in your own house, I know that the two of you will find each other in love, laughter, in charm, and your own brand of magic. And as you come together in your own house, may you build a home with your hearts.